YouTube, what's going on? Tanner here with NFL Broadcaster. So I've got some Packers news for you guys, um, and it involves running back Aaron Jones. But before I get into that, I'm going to ask you guys to go ahead and hit subscribe because we have an issue here on the channel. We have about 96% of the viewers are not subscribed to the channel. So if those 96% of viewers subscribed, um, it just means that many people could come back again for my future videos. So guys, it just takes a second to hit subscribe, so please do that. Anyways, let's get on with the Packers news. Um, there's reports to NBC Sports that Packers, <clears throat> Packers running back Aaron Jones could be seeking $15 million per year on his new contract. Um, I don't see the Packers paying him $15 million a year. That's a little uh, absurd for a running back. It makes sense, I mean, Running backs, I think Christian McCaffrey is making, a, I don't know how much per year. Um, I think he had like a record-setting <laughs> um, extension. But you just, everyone has learned that you just don't want to extend a running back. Look at Ezekiel Elliott with the Dallas Cowboys. Um, my guess is that he's going to hit free agency and get signed by someone else. The Green Bay Packers are not going to bring back Aaron Jones for $15 million a year. Now, if he will settle for less than that, they will gladly work out a deal with uh, Aaron Jones. But I don't see the Packers signing Aaron Jones for $15 million a year. That's just not something that's in the books right now for the Packers, especially that they're trying to make cuts, restructure contracts, and um, sign free agents for to help improve the team overall. Like, uh, hopefully signing J.J. Watt, and I don't really think that's going to happen, but and they need to sign veteran wide receivers as well. So tell me what you guys think down in the comments below. Aaron Jones is not going to be back on the Green Bay Packers if he's seeking $15 million a year. Tell me what you think, though. Do um, you think if it's the Green Bay Packers, will he settle for less than $15 million a year? Or is he going to seek that, not get paid that by the Green Bay Packers, and uh, hit free agency and get signed elsewhere? Because um, that's, uh, that's a lot of money, guys. $15 million a year. And uh, if you've looked at Ezekiel Elliott, he got extended and hasn't done anything, I think, in 2019, 2020. I still think Ezekiel Elliott is a great running back. Um, and he's had an offensive line that's been getting hurt. And it was, it was a star-studded offensive line that has kind of gone to crap over the last couple of years. But I, it's just a risky play to pay a running back that kind of money. So tell me what you guys think down in the comments below. Make sure you subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. See you later.